When it comes to substance abuse, Cody Gagnus says words matter. Just that there's a lot of stigma. He's telling his story in hopes that others understand addiction can happen to anyone. Since he was a child, Cody has been active. Yeah, I grew up playing uh, soccer, baseball, taekwondo, snowboarding. At 11 years old, he broke his ankle playing soccer. Percocet dulled the pain, but eventually taking pills became habit. Allow me to get out of myself, you know, because I didn't really like who I was. By the time he was 16, Cody was using heroin. Cheaper, by far, more potent, um, did the job better. But that came with a lot of consequences. While under the influence, Cody says he was suspended from Alvern High School, was arrested, and totaled his car, fracturing his back. You know, and from all the broken bones also, I got arthritis, you know? Getting up in the morning hurts a little bit. You know, only 20, so it'll get worse. But four months ago, after years of addiction and isolation, he decided he had enough. Tried killing myself before. Luckily, I'm still here. I believe I'm here for a reason now today. Now 20 years old, he lives in a Manchester recovery home and mentors others who are addicted. I don't know, I'm just at peace with myself now. I'm happy. Like in the morning, I wake up. My hardest decision is where do I get coffee? which is pretty awesome, I think. Even though his darkest days are behind him, Cody says there are still challenges, a message he brings to others trying to turn their lives around. For me was I can't get overconfident and think, oh, I got this, like I'm cured. Because for me, it's like an everyday fight, an everyday battle. Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.